there is advanced restart button in this room as you can see press that and go to recovery boot into recovery if you don't have that you can press the volume up button and power button simultaneously in order to boot into recovery i already given the links for latest firmware and this twrp latest recovery links in my community section you can check out in my channel there is a separate community section you can check out there as you can see this is the 3.6.0 11 to surya latest twrp go to wipe section select advanced wipe and select dalvik catch data there is metadata should be downside in previous video i selected that also in confusion that's not to be added here swipe here to wipe it done go to install and select the storage micro sd card wherever you downloaded the rom zip file first flash the firmware 12.5.5 surya global this is the latest firmware available for poco x3 done again go to install and select here rom zip file today i am flashing this ancient os shield 6.2 surya steel latest build with february 27 you can see here as you can see with february 27 build gfs variant this is it takes little bit of time to flash the rom wait until it gets flashed as you can see rom zip file has successfully flashed go to home section and select here wipe again and select format data and type here yes and press this tick button done go to reboot and select system that's how the flashing method of ancient os latest version for poco x3 it takes a little bit of time to boot for first time wait until it gets booted as you can see it's booted into ancient os let's begin this video hey hi hello welcome back to my new video guys this is sampathy watching sampath sam fx youtube channel this is the poco x custom rom reviews here ancient os 6.2 shield steel build type and android version is 12 you can check out here and february 5th latest security patch and the build date is 27th february and the kernel user is 4.14.190 quick silver puff surya kernel has been used and selling status is m forcing i have been running the cp throttling test from last five seven minutes you can check out here the maximum is 145 and average is 142 and minimum is 134 no cp thermal throttling detected the performance is next level and customization is also next level let's see one by one and coming into widgets you get these android 12 widgets here as you can see you can drag and use like this if you want you can choose some of the other presets also that's working fine coming into dialer let me increase the volume a little bit you get direct video call feature that's available no problem regarding that in this rom let's see call recording yes there is a call recording but the other person will notify that your call is been recorded that kind of call recording is available and let's see the benchmark results and the benchmark results are pretty good in this rom you get 3 lakh 60000 and temperature range is just 0.7 degree celsius and 3% battery drain has been notice during this and to testing the scores are really good coming into geekbench scores here also you get plenty of very good score only as you can see 523 single score and 1591 multi score 550 above that it's good but anyhow this how the scores and kernel is linux 4.14.190 kixel these are just benchmark results actual performance is really good and i'll be showing the bgma gameplay also and you get camera application here i mean i have installed separately there was no any camera application pre installed with this rom i just installed this arno build gcam you can see here it's working fine even video everything you can make it out using that gcam port and coming to drm info here you get level 1 certification so that you can watch all the ott applications in hd resolution and google photos unlimited storage is available and coming to quick settings panel this how the 
quick settings panel advanced restart button is also there and uh, screen recording options let me show you as you can see there are plenty of options device audio and microphone you can record simultaneously that's present these are the quick settings panel and coming into wallpapers let's see you won't get any under 12 wallpaper just this ancient wallpaper is printed coming to safety net status here it get failed for some reason and you can make it out using magic's models or safety net set fix you can flash during the flashing method and uh, coming into payment applications and all you need to make this pass first then you can use those things it going to working fine let me go into settings here actually here there are plenty of settings first let's see the basic settings app settings you get default apps from here you can change the default apps special app access plenty are given you can check out here individually you can adjust them coming into notifications you get notification bubbles and conversations and enhanced notifications plenty of options you can check out here all are working fine and allow face lock on lock screen you can use this option here when swiping on lock screen you can turn it on or disable that from here also and coming into battery and battery life you can see here 1 hour 24 minutes ago and screen on time is 1 hour 3 minutes it's really good and i've been testing it out and during the flashing you can check out here the battery percentage and what's currently and at the end of the video what's the battery percentage i will show you it's really good the battery life is also and you can see here battery temperature and optimization profiles battery manager is given but there is no extreme battery saver of Android 12 is missing here in this ROM coming into sound settings you get all the basic sound settings included with this Dirac sound settings you can choose the headphone type and preset from here clear speaker option is also given screenshot shutter sound pre-app volume control touch vibration touch sounds dial pad tones charging sounds and vibration plenty are given even ringtone vibration pattern also you can choose from here which is really good the customization is really good and media player also you can enable from here these are the sound settings basic things and extra customization are present in this room coming into display dark thing turn it on and good thing in wing, good thing is this you can enable the pitch black condition as you can see pitch black system it will become dark enough that's i really like it that's i am missing in android 12 roms should add like this options then only it will be better i don't think so many will use that gray type color but they should add like this options to use pitch black condition in dark mode font size display size smallest width night light is also given intensity you can adjust and colors option plenty of given minimum refresh rate maximum refresh rate and low power refresh rate and product detection tap to wake prevent accidental wake up ambient display is also working fine no problem regarding that lcd features are given and display colors you can manually adjust the saturation and contrast level i mean deep customization available in display settings also wallpaper sun style app grid you can choose only 4 into 4 and 5 into 5 that's how it is some missing like options it will be available in some other settings let's see and into the security you get fingerprint face unlock smart lock even app locker is also pre-installed in this rom which is really good encryption and credentials phone not encrypted this is not encrypted rom privacy settings you get all the basic and at all settings location is also working fine no problem regarding that too let's see under the hood you get plenty of options here in customization status bar you get plenty of options you can check out here battery style you can choose from here plenty are given I kept to me UI version 2 battery custom dimension also you can adjust from here that's really cool plenty of customization deep customization i can say that's present in this rom battery image battery layout parameter alpha fill alpha rainbow color custom color battery level those things are given even you can adjust the ulti icon on vivo fi icon too coming into themes you get a dark theme as i said before you can schedule and you can change the colors here body font and head headline font is also given plenty of options you can change the icon pack also you can change from here 
coronet radius style and monet engine also you can enable or disable from here you can force the black theme also this are the theme section coming into quick settings here also plenty of options you can see those things are given smart pull down and quick qs pull down battery estimation those things are given vibrate on touch coming into power menu you get advanced restart burner and some of the options you can use from here into the gestures aosp gestures shortcuts are given like three finger screenshot those things are working fine double tap to check phone one handed mode and system navigation go to gesture navigation plenty of option you can see here you can adjust the pill height margin button and pill width also you can adjust from here it's really good deep customization everywhere is present that's i really liking in this room even the benchmark results and actual performance is also good and battery life is also good this could be one of the best roms available for poco x3 it depends upon you how you use it and overall it's a very good rom double tap to check phone prevent ringing those options are also given touch screen gestures also plenty are given in this rom coming into navigation bar you can choose the different types of navigation icon style animations also plenty are given battery power saving battery power saving profile nothing new here just battery extreme saver should be added but it's missing oh, but anyhow do comment down below guys how many of you use that and unlock higher fps in games this is also available here unlock high quality streams unlimited photo storage this all miscellaneous settings its game space is also given and frame rate in screen record is also given game space you can enable from here there are plenty of options here you can disable usb begging debugging and swipe gestures and those things also you can enable or disable from here this are the ancient os settings plenty are given you can see here there is still more customization you can check out here you can definitely try it out as a daily driver in this rom let's see the bgmi gameplay how it handle bgmi and what all the graphic settings you get let's see in this video as you can see you get that graphic settings smooth plus extreme and 90 fps hd and high no beyond that settings but smooth plus extreme and 90 fps are given which is pretty good that you need to enable as i shown in the ancient ones settings there you need to enable actually and volume is also pretty loud let me try to enable this fps settings i don't know why it's not working that's how i don't know how to enable that let's see performance at least it's fine no lag whatsoever let me decrease the volume it's too loud can't hear I'll come back. This is the BGM gameplay in this ROM. It's working fine. Even the fingerprint unlock. Let me show you. It's also working fine. Quick enough. And let me show you the face unlock. 
it's also fast enough to unlock your smartphone app lock is also pre-installed which is very good and dark theme i really like it and battery life let me show you once again it's now 71 percent and battery usage it's pretty good as you can see one hour 34 minutes screen on time with just eight percent of battery and let me show you the charging animation you get that and a tall wobbling effect it's fine definitely you can use it as a daily driver and this is a ancient way steel latest version for poco x if you like the video give it a like and if you're still not subscribed to my youtube channel hit that subscribe button also and uh, that's all guys in this video let's check out the it's still in memory it's really good it was like around 20 minutes or half an hour before i opened this app it's still in memory the ram management is also very good in this rom that's all guys thank you for watching we'll meet you with another interesting video until that keep smiling bye bye for now